You know, someone at the park has seen something and heard something, but we need them to speak up. Family still looking for answers after a teen is shot and killed. It's our big story at five, a year without answers. Today marks one year since 17-year-old Roy Thomas's murder. It still remains unsolved. Fox 6's Brent Lemoyne joins us live now from Sherman Park with how investigators are using this day to bring new attention to the case. Yeah, and someone killed Roy Thomas here at Sherman Park. A memorial will be held at 7 o'clock this evening, but investigators hope a cash reward will lead to a big break in the case one year later. Roy was just an innocent bystander. A year has passed. He was at the park with his friends, playing, having fun, enjoying the weather. Since 17-year-old Roy Thomas was shot and killed at Sherman Park. To an individual who decided to fire a weapon at a group of children. One of those strikes hit Roy in the chest, ultimately ending his life. Detective Kimberly Alexander follows every lead, but the case remains unsolved. We know someone at the park has seen something and heard something, but we need them to speak up. This week, the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office offered a $5,000 reward for information. A video with Thomas's mom was supposed to help publicize it. Sabrina Hughes became overwhelmed with emotion and the recording stopped. Hughes tells us, quote, Roy is my oldest child. This has left me and my children broken and lost. This has been the hardest year of my life. Roy was a wonderful son and big brother. More than two dozen people were at the park when the shooting happened. Police released photos of this SUV and what they call persons of interest. The response so far, silence. You know, I think the community is so hung on on the no snitching policy. Um, or just being scared to come forward because they don't want retaliation. Finding the killer won't ever make this family whole again, but the idea of any step toward justice fuels Alexander's search for answers. What if it was your friend? Wouldn't you want someone to speak up? Wouldn't you want someone to come forward? Now, because this killing happened at a county park, it's the sheriff's office uh, that will be tasked with investigating. And just to put it in perspective, uh, the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office as an entity investigated three homicides last year, including Thomas's death. So far this year, they haven't investigated any. Reporting live at Sherman Park, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. Let's hope talking about this story brings new light to the case. Brett, thanks.